Will you have personal recognition with family members and friends? The answer is 100% yes. Where do people go when they die? Is there purgatory? Can we pray for the dead? Are there any second chances? Can they hear? Can they see? Can they feel? Do they know where they are? Do they understand where they are? Can they talk? Can they think? So on and so forth. Let's take a look at Luke chapter 16, verse number 22. It says, And it came to pass that the beggar died, that's Lazarus, and was carried by angels into Abraham's bosom. The rich man died, and he was buried. So listen, Lazarus, the beggar, is carried by angels into paradise. The rich man is buried in the ground. Both are dead. Both of their bodies have died. They're dead. They will rot, but one is born again, and the one who is born again knows his faith immediately. So look at, read the rest here, verse 23. And being in torments in Hades, he lifted up his eyes and saw Abraham afar off and Lazarus in his bosom. The rich man could see, could see heaven afar off and saw Lazarus in heaven, in paradise. And then, verse 24, he cried, the rich man, Father Abraham. He recognized the patriarch Abraham, which means likely, he was a religious man, amen? And this rich man says to Abraham, have mercy on me and send Lazarus here that I may dip the tip, that he may dip the tip of his finger in water and cool my tongue so he can see, he can taste, he can feel heat and feel pain, his mouth is dry. He says, for I am in torment in this flame. But Abraham said, son, remember that in your lifetime you received good things, and likewise Lazarus evil things, but now he is comforted and you are tormented. That's verse 25. And verse 26, and besides, all this between us and you, there is a great gulf fixed, so that those who want to pass from here to you cannot, nor can those from there pass to us. And then he says in verse 27, the rich man, I beg you therefore, Father, that you would send him to my father's house. He's saying, let him rise from the dead. For I have five brothers that he may testify to them. He wanted Abraham to rise from the dead. He said, if Abraham it rises from the dead and goes and sees my brothers, then they'll believe that this place is real. Verse 29, Abraham said, they have Moses and the prophets. Let them hear them. Verse 30, and he said, no, Father Abraham, but if one goes to, from them, to them from the dead, they will repent. But he said in verse 31, if they do not hear Moses and the prophets, neither will they be persuaded that one will rise from the dead. So we see a lot here. We see that in heaven, that, that our spirits, for those that are born again, our spirits immediately, the Bible says to be absent from the body is to be present from the Lord. We see immediately the, 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 the poor man, Lazarus, is brought into his eternal state of glory. It's incredible. But the rich man can feel, can see, can taste, and he can regret. That means that when you make it to heaven, hopefully one day, and you see your loved ones coming to meet you, to be with you, yes, you will know them. 
the rich man knew that he had brothers. The rich man wanted Abraham to rise from the dead. He was aware, he was conscious, he was, he was, he was aware of his surroundings. So the answer is yes, 100% yes. So make sure you do this. Make sure that you don't seek heaven to be with your loved ones. Make sure you seek heaven to live eternally with him. Will you know your wife? Will you know your husband? Will you know your children? Absolutely, but that is not the reason why we are saved. Because the first thing that we will say when we enter the gates of heaven is I want to see Jesus. I hope this video gives you clarity on what awaits us. For no eye has seen nor ear has heard what God has in store for those who love him. God bless you in Jesus' glorious name. Don't forget to subscribe put those comments below. Amen. God bless. I hope this video was a blessing to you. And if it was, please don't forget to subscribe below and put your comments down there as well. Also, if you are interested in making a donation to this ministry, uh, please go ahead in the description box. There's a link down there for you to make your donation. Also, please check out our website. It's also in the description box as well. May God bless you. Thank you for watching. See you around.